And dozens of national emergencies have been made throughout history, but President Trump may set a bigger president. KNWA's Kitty Davila is live in studio with why one local professor says this declaration is one to watch. Well, Jennifer, according to the New York Times, 58 national emergencies have been declared since the National Emergency Act was passed in 1976. John Brown University professor Dr. Daniel Bennett says previous national emergencies have been tied to things like wars and economic problems facing the nation. He adds President Trump's executive order may make history in a much bigger and different way. Bennett believes the president's move could give future presidents more leeway in declaring a national emergency. It's not hard to imagine in the scenario a future Democratic president getting into office and saying, well, we do have a national emergency of gun violence or we have a national emergency related to climate change, so we're going to issue all these uh, orders in the name of an emergency. What do lawmakers do then? Bennett adds if challenges are made, President Trump's declaration will go to the Supreme Court where it could be struck down. Live in studio, Katie Devilla, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.